Detectives collect evidence from the five acre property where three people were found dead after friends hadn't heard from them since Christmas. Down. Our goal is to recreate that moment in time in which the people were murdered. And to do that, we had to get as much information as we can, whether it be physical evidence or uh, statements from people who may know any type of a motive why this has happened. Police identified the victims as Daryl Iverson, his son Jordan, and Jordan's 26-year-old girlfriend, Tiffany May. Investigators tell us all three of the victims were shot multiple times. The father and son left covered with tarps. The girlfriend discovered in a shed. Police say this house was not on their radar and that none of the victims had serious criminal records. The property is described by authorities as a crash pad where people, some of them homeless, would stay for a while. One family friend said some, quote, very questionable people had spent time here and police are looking for them right now. Based on just the information that we have and how the scene's out, um, it believes that that person might have been a person that may have been staying here or knew the people here, so. Okay. You know, we don't we don't believe it's anything random. Investigators have set up a special tip line that they're hoping people will call to help them track down this killer. That number is 360-417-2540, and we will link that to this story on King5.com. For now, near Port Angeles, Eric Wilkinson, King 5 News.